Vermont high school basketball needs to get off my lawn. Bernie Sanders, Vermont. Last week, the Mid-Vermont Christian School girls basketball team gallantly canceled its playoff matchup against Long Trail after discovering one of the players they would be forced to compete against is a male. Rose Johnson, the athlete in question, is supposedly the tallest member of the Long Trail girls team and apparently goes by the nickname Rose not in this house, Johnson, due to the young man's ability to easily block shots, allegedly even recording seven in one game. Headmaster of MVCS Vicky Fogg issued the following statement. We withdrew from the tournament because we believe playing against an opponent with a biological male jeopardizes the fairness of the game and the safety of our players. Now, I have not seen a single practice nor one second of game footage from the Mid-Vermont girls team, but I think it's safe to assume that not many of those young ladies will play professional basketball or even compete at the collegiate level, which means some of those seniors sacrificed their final chance to play organized basketball in order to make a statement that should have been unnecessary in the first place. Where are the Vermont adults? Where are the leaders hiding? Remaining silent, hoping this issue will blow over, I can assure you it will not. Our children are looking to us for leadership. They are hungry for guidance, desperate for direction, searching for moral teachings. We cannot fail them. Today, the opportunity to compete in a safe and fair environment was seized from a group of girls in a small Vermont town. But tomorrow, that opportunity could be taken from your daughter or your sister. Stand up now and lend your voice to reason. And to those Vermont adults who failed these young ladies, Get off my lawn. Very nice. Yes, David. sir, Coney. Good. I heard her nickname was Rose. I promise I don't have a Johnson. <laughs> mm. Well, this show's good. <laughs> what? Fun show. Oh, oh man. man. Oh boy. No, well, good. again, again, you're you're gonna let 14 year old girls play against a dude. There's only one way to fix this. It's a dude, a tall dude, too? D apparently. There's only one what? way to fix this, guys. How are we doing it? Hands in. Hands in? We doing it? No. Are we, are we, do we have to fix it? Huh? Captain Planet? We go play women's basketball? Oh, man. That's hmm. what, like, actually go play against women? In Vermont? In Wherever. Vermont? Wherever. There's only one way to fix this. You get three mediocre guys who are not good at basketball to go win all the basketball accolades you can win. Like, can I just, can, well, look, I, I just, again, and, and this is something that we talked, we've obviously talked with Riley Gaines about how, how stupid can we be? Like, how stupid can we be? Like, stop letting men play against women and girls. Against girls. Against 14-year-old girls. I mean, we have parents that take their kids to these trans shows and we're letting men play in women's sports. Like, what? How stupid are you? Rose, get out of my house. <laughs> Can you imagine, like, not only like, I think accepting better. that moniker, but celebrating it? And like, if I'm a, if, if, look, it, it's just. We have no pride. Like, well, our pride's screwed up. We got a different type of pride now. It's like, again, just, I don't know how, how a competitor as a male, you would feel about competing against women. Like, how you could lay your head down the pillow at night, even as a 14-year-old. Like, there, there's a blame. Look, sometimes we, so, p p uh, positivity bullying. No, right? bullying's necessary in life. Like, somebody, like, again, I'm sorry. Like, Or you just, get what you see now. Yeah, that's this exactly what right. This get. is what happens. This is what happens. Like, it's just, it's absolutely... That was a really good get off my lawn. Thank that you. Was, that was one appreciate of my favorites, David. Hey, YouTube, I appreciate you guys. Just hit over 50,000 subs. Let's get to 100,000 twice as fast. Make sure you subscribe, share the show, like it, like the videos you see, and turn on that notification bell so you can check it every time we drop content.